Hello everybody, uh, Black Hearts Pop Culture here with a really cool uh, revealing video. Uh, if anything, I can't remember if, uh, for one of my uh, particular plushies, uh, if, or at least uh, for uh, the Build-A-Bear uh, plushies or stuffed animals, depending on what you prefer to be calling them. Uh, from one of my previous uh, reviews, not really anything to do with Pokemon, but uh, not... not for any of the Pokemon Builder Bears, what I'm trying to say, but, um, that, uh, for my other ones I've just recently done that is non-Pokemon, I, uh, I think I don't know if I actually mentioned anything of another reveal that I would have done, um, uh, later on from what I, uh, I think I might have said, because I can't remember if I ever hinted at, uh, a particular thing that I ordered or whatnot, since it was a bit of a while ago, since last time I, uh, did that, um, uh, particular review and when you see what I got here you'll understand what I'm talking about so uh without anything uh trying to go too deep into uh, the story of this particular thing I'm going to be showing you because uh what ended up happening uh I was supposed to be getting this particular package uh, it was uh last Friday well technically Thursday then it got rescheduled to Friday in which uh, I guess there's something of uh they couldn't figure out or the person that that was supposed to be in charge of the delivery. I guess I couldn't really figure out where exactly I lived. In which uh, apparently I went back to where it was. In which uh, after um, a little bit part of my uh, work. I was able to get my package. Because uh, one of the particular trucks which was UPS. That was supposed to be uh, delivering it. The person actually had the package on their. Uh, you know on the particular truck that they had it in. In which you know they were delivering stuff at the place I work at, so I asked and that he had it. So without really much further delay, and I'm really happy to actually get to tell you about this, because if anything, um, this is actually my very first time ever uh, getting something from this particular company, especially uh, anything on a online website other than Amazon and any of the other places I usually do. Well, mostly Amazon and Build a Bear uh, Workshop website. So I'm really happy to get it. So as you can see, it's very big right here. And as you can see, you can see an iconic character right there. And this is the magic's in the mail. I am so happy to finally get to open this because it was somewhat of a few hours before I got off of work that I really wanted to go and, uh, you know, to open this. But since I still had to work, I couldn't, you know, open it around that time. So let's get this little part open here. I'm going to go across this. It's a big plushy. Oh, I see it. I'm starting to see it. Okay. Okay. Yeah, not really much of uh, introductions are uh, to be uh, said or told. i like you guys all to meet. Oh man, I know you already see right here. This is up for plastic covering. Hold on. Oh, is there like a thing here or so? No, huh? This is so weird. Usually there's like a way you can take it out of the thing without having no. Oh, like usually there's like a adhesive type thing or something like that. Okay, I know it's kind of anticlimactic and whatnot, but still. Bear witness with me here a little bit. Okay. My 18 inch official, uh, as you can see by this little tag right here, especially where it came from, too. My official uh, uh, my, uh, Disney official. Hold on. You can kind of see. I'm sorry if it's a little bit blurred. Maybe if you can kind of, or at least, there we go. You can kind of make it out right there. It's my. Official, uh, Turning Red, Malin Lee, or also too, uh, with the little thing right here as well, little key, you know, card right there. But if anything, my very first, my very, uh, my official, uh, Malin Lee, uh, Turning Red, Red Panda plushie that I got. I'm really happy to, oh my, it looks so cool. Especially considering this looks a lot more detailed. I mean, I'm saying, I'm, you know, you know, saying anything bad about the Build-A-Bear version, but I think this particular uh, plushie is a little bit more uh, detailed and also more to the color 
of uh, mail, you know, for mail inlay and whatnot. And I think the t uh, tail right here is a little bit more bushier and whatnot. And also, too, you can actually get pods on, you get like paw pads on these, which I'm really happy to actually to be seeing here. Though, uh, the only thing I would have to say, it's uh, kind of a shame that you know, I mean, not that you really could do much of anything with the particular uh, hands of uh, for the Builder Bear ones, but at least they were more out than anything, but still really cool. Like a little indentation with her cheek right here. Really nice, really nice, super soft, and you know, nice cuddling and whatnot because this is supposed to be 18 inches for this particular plushie there was one that took a eight, uh, eight nine point one and a half inch but to the majority part that i am so happy because i am a really big fan of uh, uh turning red i know i'm not really wearing anything as you can see with my gengar hat and my uh hello kitty uh shirt i got here that i, I really wish to be getting particular things i might see about uh ordering some stuff from turning red because i've seen certain shirts some of them being uh, out of stock and whatnot, so I, I really don't know exactly how I'm going to do with that. I have seen some stuff uh, for uh, the Disney website, which I have. Uh, this is how I got uh, this particular mail and lane plushie. Um, I'm not entirely sure exactly when I'm going to be going to do that kind of stuff, or if I am going to order them. Uh, next thing I do want to do, which I might show you guys on this video, or in a video, uh, in this uh, website. Or not website, you know what I mean, on the channel. That, um... There's like this really cool, um, I don't know if it's either, uh, what's what I'm looking for, either if it's um, a specific type of enamel pin, or uh, at the very least a really, uh, really cool pin, it's uh, her and her red panda form, and then all of her friends are all like on her uh, body, and I don't know if she's like supposed to be like in a jumping move type thing, I might order that. Uh, there's a particular hat that I really don't get. Because it's like a, one of those face hats and whatnot with the ears and whatnot. The only thing I don't get about the whole thing is that uh, they're, they got instead of like regular eyes, it's like button eyes, but the button eyes are white. When you think at the very least, if you're gonna do something like that, do like a pop vinyl and just do two black dots for eyes or two black buttons. It doesn't really make sense to have two white, you know, button eyes for you know eyes when you can't really tell with it or even. How her eyes are. They're, they're brown. And you can just do two brown eyes or whatnot. Or two brown buttons. And anything. But again it's really cool. You know that they actually get to do a lot more merch stuff. Kind of a shame though. That when you know a lot of stores like Hot Topic. Or any like you know. Oh well, I'm not sure exactly for Target and Walmart. If they ever did anything. And you know since Kmart's out of business. Or at least to a specific point. Other than that. I really want to go on a particular tangent, and I mean, if you guys want me to say stuff about that, who knows, maybe my next video, something like that. But anything, I am just so happy to finally get this plushie. I, I love this plushie so much, so nice and fluffy, uh, you know, a nice, more cuddling, you know. I mean, the other one was a good cuddling one, but, I mean, I think it was more of, like, the tail was, like, me. Nowadays, like, you know, I mean, it's, this one's kind of more, a little bit more flat compared to, like, how thick and whatnot the... Uh, my build a bear one is and at the very least you know it, it, it's a lot more up, up to my acceptable height or at least a ratio of me versus the plush because you know i always like having you know you know having it you know close by me when i'm either watching uh turning red or anything else in that for a you know particular thing um i also kind of like how her, her ears are a little bit more like there's like more uh of a space Type thing, not that it's really important, but I don't know. Just like I kind of like it because it kind of gives it a little bit more, you know, fun. They do a lot more fun here. I mean, especially like again, I I, just, I love how they got like individual paws right here. You know, I I like this you know stuff because they didn't have the paws in the thing. I think all it was is like one little big pad. I don't even think there was anything for it. But you know, at the very well, at least, because especially like in the one scene for Turning Red, they actually have you know I heard doing the little paw print. Which, if I had anything, I really that would be a pretty cool thing that they would, uh, if anything, for Disney to be doing, would be uh, having uh, you know like where you can either it'll be like the the stamp itself, and then you have like the little ink box thing, or at the very well, at least one of those ones where you open it up and it's already got the ink inside the pad, and then you just like you know whatever, and then it's like it's her paw. You know, or at least maybe paw, and then maybe like somehow like try to do like Malin Lee or May Lee or something like that, like in the you know the the center part of the hand paw type thing. You know, at the very least, you know something fun. I mean, you don't you don't really see a lot of stamps nowadays and everything like that.
But above all else, I'm really happy to finally get in this uh, particular uh, particular plushie. I really hopefully to be seeing a lot more. I mean, it seems like uh, not a lot of stuff has been said about turning red. I mean, certain people are still doing certain videos. Isaac Carlson hasn't really been doing a lot of stuff since he's busy with other things. And most of our else, I really hope that at least something comes uh, later on, like either being another movie, maybe a little like TV spinoff, like probably you know exclusively for Disney Plus, or at the very least, maybe like a little little snippets they could possibly do, like how they do with the thing with the uh, Simpsons, with the little, not you know having to do with particular celebrities or doing with whatever, but at least you know to actually use Mei Lin Lee and and, uh, and her family because there, there's more potential in this movie this was a great movie it, it did very well it's a shame that they never did it in theaters because I'm pretty sure it'd be doing this about the same as uh, Luca did you know or if not that uh, not Luca um, or, I mean I think Luca was in theaters too but I think it was uh, Enchanto yes Enchanto is what I'm thinking of so, uh, with that in mind, that's about as much as I can possibly say without, like, you know, just rambling on with more and more stuff. So, uh, with that in mind, guys, both me and, uh, which I'll be calling this one, uh, calling this mainly, uh, Red Panda, or, or on the actual tag it says Red Panda May. I'm gonna call her May May. Or, I don't know, May, just regular May. I, it depends. May, I'll, I'll do May for the actual name and then May May for the for a little like nickname and whatnot so uh with that in mind guys thank you guys all for watching my video if you have subscribed to my youtube channel please do if you have subscribed to my youtube channel make sure you hit that bell notification so you get any notifications of present and future videos if you like this video give it a like if you have any suggestions that you want to see for my next youtube channel anything you want to see my youtube channel or anything you want to see my next video is what i was trying to say or anything at all write it down in the comment section below thank you guys all for watching my video and i'll see you guys all next time bye